All right, guys, we're doing Selena Gomez today. Come and get it. Just a few chords to it, and not hard. I'm going to show you a little, you know, to kind of funk it up a little bit. in the right hand a little bit and then, uh, all right so a little fun song for you right hand starts out these chords uh, if you have a keyboard you can put a string sound or a, a uh, you know layer a, a patch it's kind of a pad piano or something like that but anyway, hello, I'm Sean Cheek. Welcome to my Easy Piano Lessons. Hope you like my new HD camera and the new angle, all the stuff I'm able to do with this new camera. I'm ashamed of the camera I've, I hung on to, uh, just because I didn't know. I didn't know uh, what a, a difference, uh, how, how cheap the digital cameras were now, and also uh, how, what a difference it would make. Because my other one was, was HD too, but apparently nothing like this. All right, so B flat, D, G. And the right, left hand, we're going to do a G octave. One, two. Four, one, two, then we'll do the D, F, B flat, while the left hand goes to B flat, two, three, four, then we'll do an E flat chord, B flat, E flat, G, left hand on an E flat octave, two, three, four, and then C, E flat, G, left hand on a C octave, two, three, four, and then dot to dot, everybody who knows my dot to dot knows to go back and go, four, one, two, three, four, and then... Now, that's the chord. It's, it's you know, not played loudly, but it's held there like that. It's F and G with a thumb, and then B flat and F. This is only at the beginning, okay? When you do that repeat, left hand on an E flat octave, and you just hold it. So when you go back and do the dot to dot, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. All right? It's a, a, a E flat add nine chord, all right? And then when she starts singing, you can add a little bit of... Something like ba 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 together left right left right together left right left right together left right and it just does those four you don't you don't encounter that one again just these four. minute 21 something else happens three chords so at minute 21 in the song these four chords that you've been hearing all over don't happen you have B flat D G and then it goes to B flat D F is a B flat 6 4 chord and then uh, we go to G B flat E flat with the left hand on an E flat uh, uh, minute 21 now here's the melody if you want to do this who was with the melody in the right hand stop doing that learn the chords and, and start singing with your songs that you love okay everybody can sing everybody can sing start playing the chords and start trying to sing that'll be much more satisfying to you than just playing putting the melody in the right hand all the time yeah that's kind of what we like to do sometimes but you will enjoy it much better if you start singing don't sing in front of people sing by yourself get used to it and then you can can sing in front of people but uh, start trying to do that because it's a lot more fun you'll just love it so much but I, I'm gonna show you the melody here for fun G G G G G G G F D C B flat G these chords are the chords right here okay so you can start out like this now that G is right here following your P what I was doing before is just going all right and we don't have time to go into all that uh, here in this this short video but there's a part in there that goes um, you know that part I'm talking about it's electronic sound all that is is a pentatonic scale and uh, we're doing 
I'll just show you F, G, D, F, C, D, B flat, C, then it will continue G, B flat, F, G, D, F, C, D. We can do a lesson on what a pentatonic scale is later if, if we need be, but I think it happens after the E flat chord, now you know. somewhere in there but that's something to play around with a little pentatonic scale just a little quick lesson for you hope you guys enjoy it please subscribe to my channel lots more fun little pop songs to come